George Galloway is in the news for having a right old rant at the BBC and the licence fee. Maybe I'm going to start liking him all of a sudden. Let's take a look at the story and find out. As I said, George Galloway has been on RT News having a right old rant about the BBC and the licence fee. Good for him. That's what I've been doing for the last couple of years on this YouTube channel. Let's take a look at this story and let's see if I'm going to start liking George Galloway again or not. George Galloway railed against the TV licence fee in a furious attack on the British broadcaster. Speaking on RT, Mr Galloway said that not only are the BBC's days numbered, it cannot come quick enough for me. This follows up an earlier rant launched by Mr Galloway this week where he lashed out at the BBC for becoming something alien to the British public. Well, it looks like we're on the same team, doesn't it? Me and Mr Galloway. Maybe I should start watching RT News more. On catch up, obviously, because I can't watch it live because they don't have a TV license. Anyway, we'll talk about that. What else has it got to say in this story? Mr. Galloway said the BBC is no longer speaking for Britain. It is speaking to Britain at our expense. And we go to prison if we don't pay them to lie to us. I think not only are its days numbered, but it cannot come quickly enough for me. Or me either, Mr. Galloway. The quicker they go, the better, bloody BBC. He later posted the clip to his social media feed, tweeting, The BBC doesn't talk for Britain, it talks to us. Who writes BBC comedy? Who pays them to do it? We do. And if you don't pay your licence fee, which pays them, you go to jail. The end of this nonsense can't come soon enough. Earlier this week, Mr Galloway argued that the broadcaster had signed its own death warrant. He claimed the corporation is less trusted than rival broadcasters as he attacked the sneering BBC for putting out upper-middle-class propaganda. The National Broadcaster has come under fire in recent days after announcing the cost of the annual TV licence will be hiked by £1.50 to £159 from April the 1st. Yeah, as mentioned there, the TV licence is going up. And if you still have a TV licence, I implore you, get it cancelled. You won't miss anything. I'm telling you now. I'll put a link above and watch this video and it tells you everything you can watch without a TV licence. And you are not going to miss much, I promise you. And it's so much easier as well. You don't have to wait like for nine o'clock on a Thursday to your favourite show to be on. You can just watch what you want whenever you want to watch it. So give that video up there a look and cancel your TV licence and join the fight with George here and myself and between us we'll all get the BBC cancelled. It'll be brilliant. So what do you think about this story? Do you like George Galloway? Let me know in the comments below and we'll have a bit of a chat about it. I'm starting to come round to the guy I think. So I might have a look at a look at some more of his stuff and see what's going on there. But I'll see you in another video again soon. Thanks for watching. Oh, before you go, I just want to let you know that I've got some t-shirts and some mugs and things that I've designed that'll let people know that you don't pay your TV license or encourage a conversation to help you convert them to not paying their TV license. You'll find the links below. And there's also some links there for products that I recommend you buy on Amazon. Anyone who buys anything gets me a little bit of a kickback and that goes to paying for my website, TV License Stop. .co.uk, which helps people every day to cancel their TV licenses. So you'll be part of helping support that and helping more people all around the country. Thank you.